<laughs> Welcome to Geisley Presents Fun Fish Facts with C. Blake, and we're going to continue our Shark Summer Series. With that, it's the Hammerhead Part 2, and we're going to actually be showing about eating time with a shark. And hammerheads have a favorite food. It is the stingray. And as you see, the stingray is actually trying to leap out of the water away from uh, a particular giant hammerhead in this case. The thing is though, usually uh, stingrays will actually be hiding in the sand. That's where they look. As you can see, they can quickly burrow and you can just see their eyes. So again, how is a shark finding these, uh, these animals, their favorite food? Well, hammerheads and all, basically all sharks and hammerheads in particular have special senses that can actually help find uh, these animals. And they're called the ampullae of Lorenzini. And what these are, you can see that here, if you look at all these little pores, these are all the ampullae of Lorenzini. And these little pores, and if you look here, you'll see actually how it works. And basically, uh, Donald Lorenzini discovered this in, in the 1600, 1647 or something like that. And what he's noticed is that there are all these kind of little ampules, little vase-like uh, structures from the pores that are full of this jelly. It's, this jelly is electroconductive. And what happens is when the shark will actually sense uh, electric fields in the water, being like other animals, especially like the, uh, the stingray, it can actually sense the stingray underneath the sand because of these. So uh, the, the electric disturbances or electric voltage in the water will basically stimulate the jelly, which will stimulate the, uh, these kind of like, if you look uh, over here, it'll stimulate the, uh, the concilia and the nerve cells down at the bottom of this. And then it'll say, hey, okay, there's something there. And what's really interesting is that again, because of the shape of the hammerhead shark, because it's got such a long, um, wide rostrum, it's got a lot more uh, area to sense the, uh, the sense of seeing right. And then of course, when it finds one down the sand, it'll kind of go down and uh, pin it, and then it can eat it that way. So it's really kind of fun that way. And again, these are really great animals. And I think next week I'm gonna show you exactly uh, how we can ride one. Actually not, we're not doing that. We're actually gonna probably do uh, some great white sharks or something even more fun. So again, thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time and I'll see you later, bye.